Hey, what's up guys? This is Steve. Hey, I thought I'd uh, share my favorite meatloaf recipe. I like to make grass-fed organic meatloaf. Um, let me show you how I did it or how I do it. Uh, I already started and then I was like, well, shoot, I might as well uh, film a video because I think you guys need to, you know, check this out. I'm doing it, but all I do is use gluten-free roll old-fashioned rolled oats. This is what you do. You take the the rolled oats and half a cup put it in a bowl. What you want is a fourth cup. Use organic ketchup. And I didn't have any uh, onions, so I had to use chopped onions, but these are okay. They're from Costco, and they're just chopped onions, dried. What you want to do with that is if you use real onions, just finely, you know, mince them. Or you can use these, it's fine. And you want a, a fourth cup of onions. Then you want to use one organic egg that I already threw in there. And you want a teaspoon of salt. I prefer Himalayan salt. And a half a teaspoon of black pepper. Alright guys, if you can see this. This is Himalayan pink salt. And I want one teaspoon of Himalayan pink salt. This is excellent salt. Very good for you. 84 minerals in this in this sucker. Throw it in there. You want a half a teaspoon of black pepper. Pepper's going to be hard because um, I, I have to grind it so I'm not even worried about it so I like pepper. I'm just going to throw it in there. Now, you want a pound of organic ground beef. However, this is a little over a pound because it came from Costco. It's a little, little more. So what you want to do to um, keep this from, from offsetting is you can add just a little bit more... Uh, ketchup in there but I think you're fine you could probably do uh, another egg but in my opinion just just add a little more ketchup and you're fine I get this at Costco it's organic ground beef and the great thing about this is you, you buy three of them for like I think it's like $21.99 so it comes out to be about you know um, seven something a little over a pound which is pretty good just a little over seven but no big deal put that in there you never want to use regular cheap ground beef unfortunately because the meat nowadays is all shit. I mean, it's it's terrible, and uh, yeah, I don't mean to use that kind. Of, well, yeah, I do mean to use that language. Sorry, um, that's just how I feel. It's all shit. So, you want to uh, mix this up real good, okay? And regular onions, obviously, are going to be better to use but I didn't think I was gonna make a bit or I wasn't planning on making a video but you know it's not I don't eat meatloaf that often you know, every once in a while um, so I might as well make it make the video now while I uh, was thinking about it so you really gotta just keep rolling it over Make sure everything's mixed in there. You know, I personally probably don't even need more ketchup. I think it's fine. Because what we're going to do is we're going to put a little 
ketchup on top of it once we get into the loaf pan. Now what I do is is I just throw it in here, you know. I don't I don't do anything fancy. I just kind of form it in the loaf pan. It's not the the best way. You can you can you know form it on a like a sheet baking sheet first and then throw it in there but I don't really care now it calls for two All right. okay now we got to put ketchup on there on the top of it okay but I gotta wash my hands again two tablespoons or you can just go like this really doesn't matter you know I have to get technical I just put it on like that and then uh, if you want you can kind of smooth it out a little bit spoon or something okay once your oven is preheated you want to cook this for about you know anywhere between 30 40 minutes depending on the on your oven you know obviously you just want to make sure the meat's done so just keep checking it once it hits 30 minutes just check it Alright guys, I just took the uh, meatloaf out of the oven. I'll have you look at it here in a sec. There it is. How's that look? Alright guys, I just took the meatloaf out of the oven. This is what it looks like. It's all done. It's real tasty. So try it out. See what you think. I'll post the recipe in the uh, description of the video. All right, guys. I'm Steve. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe to the channel. Enjoy some meatloaf. Grass-fed organic.